Greetings and welcome to our meaningful meditation. This week we are indoors, kind of a rainy day here in Michigan, but I wanted to uh, introduce you to this space here at Lawn Ridge Hall. This is the place in which we have our offices and meetings. Um, it's historic, it's been here for uh, over 100 years and it's just a beautiful historic home that we have obviously kind of changed its purpose. But this is a place that I love to come and just look out the windows and look at the grounds. And it really is a place of peace, which is our theme for this coming Sunday, uh, the fourth Sunday of May, as we continue in this season of Easter, thinking about resurrection is. And this week we will be reflecting on this gift of peace that Jesus talks about in the Gospel of John, uh, chapter 14. He is giving his disciples his words of farewell and encouraging them um, to not let their hearts be troubled, but to trust in him that this gift of peace, uh, the Holy Spirit is with them, even though he is departing from them physically. And I think it's hard when you consider this whole idea about not letting our hearts be troubled, especially when there is so much around us um, that is troubling. And I think that's a lot to ask to just say, well, don't let your hearts be troubled is just not in any way realistic. But I think really what Jesus is encouraging us is to not let our troubles define us and who we are um, and not to let that anxiety overtake us, but instead to find places that bring us peace like this uh, environment here, taking a walk outside on our labyrinth or out in a park just doing some deep breathing and feeling Christ's presence all through us uh, is very helpful. I know to me when I have those days in which just seems like everything is kind of crashing down on me, um, on those that I really love, or especially as we think about our country and all the things that are going on um, with violence and misjustice. And so there's always that inspiration that Christ brings to us to not lose hope, but to feel Christ's peace. So hope that you'll find um, some encouragement in these words. If you're here in town, we'd love to have you join us this Sunday at 10 a.m. We have our new members uh, coming and also a baptism. And then uh, at noon on Zoom, we have a special guest coming to us from uh, Minneapolis, Kara Montgomery Johnson, and she is a specialist in grief and how we uh, respond to grief in our life, both when it happens uh, to a close loved one and also how it affects a church family uh, system in which there can be great loss, especially as we've you know gone through COVID and all the different experiences with that as well. So lots to consider. We hope you'll uh, check out our website. And if you have any questions, always feel free to call us here at University Presbyterian Church. So blessings and um, peace for your journey. Amen. <music>